Hello everyone, welcome to Automators Industrial Projects. I'm Santosh and in this video I will be explaining you about data types in Siemens Step 7 and uh, we have divided this uh, video in part wise and in first part we will be discussing about the element data types and in element data types um, uh, we are uh, talking about uh, character um, data type in detail. So what is data type? So it determines the properties and characteristics of data, essentially the representation of the content of one or more related addresses. And they are globally defined and can be used in any blocks. So data types are divided in two uh, types. They are elementary data types and complex data types. Elementary data types, um, they consist of one bit, one byte, word, and one double word. That means it consists of boolean that is one bit byte word double word integer double integer real time spy time and date date and character so uh, in this video we will be talking more about the character but in coming videos we will be discussing about the others and even the uh, complex data types so elementary data types um, as I said, they can occupy uh, one double word maximum and they can be processed by using the load and transfer and the declaration is done in the uh, uh, format of variable name, data type and pre-assignment. So variable name is the name of the variable, data type is element data type and pre-assignment is a fixed value. So let's see um, here um, exactly in, in DB. For example, this is a shared DB and when we go to elementary types, you can see uh, elementary types consist of bool, byte, word, double word, int, double int, etc. And this is the name and the type and the fixed value. Okay, and let's uh, start with an example. So before that, I want to clear also the character character uh, it occupies one byte and represents a single character stored in ASCII format example a which is um, um, printed in inverted commas and uh, so as I said let's check an example here this is examples of elementary data types you can see um, the data types character the static variables variable 1 2 3 are pre-assigned ascii characters so you guys know what is ascii already so uh, if you want we can just check ascii stands for american standard code for information interchange and computers can only understand numbers so an ascii code is a numerical representation of a character and here also you can see the table which i have uh, taken from the internet and here it gives the hexa number of the character and the decimal number. So here in this program, we are loading the character with the inverted commas to the variable. We can load a single character by defining the character as a byte. And when you define it as a word, then you can take the characters here as consist of uh, double word, then one, two, three, four characters can be defined right four eight thirty two okay and here sixteen so let's um, also check uh, in the ladder logic how it looks okay here I have consider a ladder logic for example I write a now you see this is character a and here also I write B. You see they are not matching because the characters are A and B. And you can see the value here. You can also check on the internet. For A we have the number 97 in decimal and for B the number is 98 in decimal. 
and in x are 61 62 so even if i make it 97 here you can see it's matching now because or make it a it's matching okay and the second thing is like the first character we have uh, defined only one uh, character with a byte in the word we have defined two and here in the double word we have defined four characters that is jack so if you want to uh, divide this jack j a c k you can also check here you see um, variable we have uh, loaded here j e c k jack that are four uh, characters in variable three so we can divide this to get the individual character in db um, we have this in db32 so dbb32 33 34 and 35 so 32 33 34 35 in so first 32 we will be have having the character j 33 a 34 c 35 k so let's check in the ladder or even you can check in the stl if you want I have already written here 32 we load let's see what is the value you see 74 I write J you see 74 74 you can also take check here um, the J value you see 74 74 and even if you want we can check here with the STL load db101 dot dbb34 and transfer to or just load it and we can see what value it consists of you see 63 representation decimal 99 and 99 you can check here 99 is C that is third uh, character out of Jack J A C and we have loaded the uh, DBB 34 so this was all about um, character you can define it in a character as a byte or word or double word and they can occupy um, in the byte as an ASCII format and so in the coming video we will be discussing about the other uh, types and complex data types in detail so this was all uh, consisting in part one thank you for watching this video uh, please watch the next part that you can understand it thank you for watching